what is up seniors so the time is upon you now to get your future set up because part of my job as your dean is this section over here to really help you with your social and emotional development and your future okay we got to start shifting away from you know what you've been doing the last couple years to really looking at what you're going to do next year whether that's college work military and so forth in that one what i need you to do is i am developing your senior tab for you here so go ahead and click on seniors it's going to take you to a google form i will definitely make this a lot more spazazzy as we go through but right now if you need a recommendation letter or a transcript for college stuff you're going to need to fill this out in detail as you go down with it okay click next and finish it on that one um, I only can process it through this way because I need to have a database of it so I know what I'm doing. So be honest in everything you need on that one. And again, this is on the Dean McLeod's webpage here. What I'm also going to do over the next two weeks is I'm going to fill out a Dean McLeod's transcript evaluation for you. So again, this is extremely informal. This is by no means official. However, this is meant for us to be able to see, are you going to graduate? Are you on track? Did you complete all your graduation requirements? And I'm gonna give you a PDF copy of this, okay? So this is what it would look like down to the bottom. In each box here, when you see a green box like this, that means you have completed that requirement and you've passed the class with above a 70%. If for some reason you see a red one here, that means you attempted the class and failed it and then you're probably doing grad lab or something, but not many of you have that, so don't worry about that. So what you'll notice here then is if I keep doing this, you'll see a bunch of green boxes. At the end, you should see a lot of green here filled up and you'll see these graphs that show everything for you. You also see a electives written here uh, plus the actual credits given the 0.5 and down here this box needs to be at 26 so when you're reading it if it's not a 26 then we have issues and I should have already talked to you about that okay put your student name ID number here I will click the box if you're gonna be a completer in that pathway if there's no box ticked then you weren't a completer in it just because you didn't take all the necessary courses needed for it that's no harm no foul it's not gonna affect your graduation but I do want to put that there also down here in the percentage these should all be at a hundred percent by the time you read it so what this does is it makes sure that you have fulfilled all the graduation requirements Last but not least down here, I will put some comments, recommendations, kudos to you for that one. So just keep going. I do want to remind this, okay, this is definitely a future projection here. So like it says in the yellow, I am going to tick your senior year classes like you're going to pass them with a 70% or above. If for some reason you do not, just know, then we're going to be in a lot different situation. This is very much a future projection, making sure that we have everything we need to graduate, okay? So take a look over it. I Again, it's going to take me about two weeks to get to everyone, so I will send that to you in uh, your team's chat individually. So just wait for me, and then as you need more, please go to the webpage and go to seniors and you'll see a bunch of stuff there you can fill out and I will help you quickly. All right, guys, let's do this.